Alright, let's go. Hi! So, today we're going to be doing another wig review. You know, as you can see, shake and go, it hit me up, shake it me up. And this is the wig that I chose. So, let's just get right on into it. I just put this wig on. And I've been playing around in it for about 20 minutes. This is the Free Trist Equal Freedom Part Lace Front Collection in the style Freedom Part Lace 202, the color OT27, and it comes in a bunch of different colors. Those are the colors. As you can see from the card, you can have it in a right part, a left part, or a center part. I chose center part. I didn't do any plucking to the wig for video's sake, so you can see how the part looks when you first get the wig. Obviously it needs some plucking because it looks very fake <laughs> with that part. You'll need to do some type of plucking if you're going to be getting this wig. The statement on this card that says create attractive styles in any angle. Now I don't really know if I too much agree with that statement because <laughs> this right here now this wig from what i've been seeing so far is very gorgeous it's very pretty but this right here just kind of it annoys me because the wig is so gorgeous like and the hair is actually really soft and like fluffy and just very airy you know it doesn't feel like synthetic hair it feels like virgin hair and they could have they was they was a little petty with this right here they could have put dark roots throughout the whole lace front and not just the center because it's a bit annoying i guess that's why on this like on the card they completely like turn the whole wig to the side like if you want to have a side part but personally sometimes i like to do flip over methods and i like to run my fingers through my hair sometimes like sometimes i'll go like that like it's my real hair or something but if i do that this is showing and that's popping out other than that that's pretty much the only bad thing i have to say about this wig from what i've been experiencing so far like the tangling isn't super bad and coming this out goes straight through for the most part the hair is very gorgeous very very gorgeous so that's the hair when i comb it out oh yeah i do want to say when i did first like take it out of its packaging it was very gorgeous i should have recorded me taking out of the packaging and cutting the lace off but i i, I don't know i was <laughs> i forgot to but it was very gorgeous like when i first took it out like it was all in one big wave it was very uniform looking it was just very overall just very gorgeous yeah i do just i really wish that the dark roots went throughout the whole lace front and not just the center <laughs> of the hair because with these types of wigs i like to do like this little hairstyle right here like i'll pull a few hairs down in the front basically do a half up half down like that like real hair and like you didn't have dark roots all the way throughout your all of your head it doesn't really look good i've been looking for some blonde wigs i'm sorry i'll keep looking over here like some blonde synthetic wigs like some cute ones the hair is gorgeous like it literally feels like virgin hair like it literally feels like a brazilian body wave and i'm not even exaggerating <laughs> it literally feels like this wig that i have over there on my wig shelf but yeah it's like a it's like a it's like a body wave like if you wear synthetic hair often and then you kind of get that weird feeling toward the end of the uh hair it'll be very cute when you cut it into a bob also like a or maybe like a long bob like a lob if you cut it into a lob i feel like that'll be really cute too it'll be like when um beyonce and sierra had their hair shedding I have not actually gotten any shedding since I cut the lace, so that's pretty good. The tangling isn't bad at all either. Like it has like minor nabs uh, every now and then, but it's still not super like, the density is actually very nice. It's a very, a, a very natural density, I guess. Like it's not too thin, not too thick. I can run my fingers through it without it getting super tangly. I just, I can't stop looking at myself in the mirror over here. The hair is so gorgeous. Yeah, that's pretty much it. If y'all have any questions, comment down below and I will hit y'all up. If this wig changes drastically within the next, I guess, maybe week, I will put that in the description. Or at least I'll try to remember to. <laughs> if I don't, though, it means that the wig is fine. Make sure y'all follow me on my social media. Make sure y'all follow Shake and Go. Their Instagram, everything will be linked down below. Check out their website. They have a bunch of different wigs. So, yeah, that is it. Now on to my hair flipping montage, me just being extra. So that is all. Bye. Start the music. <laughs>